Democrat Doug Jones will face Republican Roy Moore in the Senate election on December 12. Jones successfully prosecuted Klansmen who bombed the 16th Street Baptist Church killing four little girls. He alluded to his victory in his statement about the Republican runoff. This job is much bigger than the occupant. As U.S. Attorney, I not only completed my term but remained a special prosecutor to ensure justice was served and Klansmen went to prison for murdering four innocent little girls. I will take the same seriousness to the United States Senate and ensure millions of Alabamians have a representative who places the people above personal ambition. His entire statement is available below since the beginning of this race. I have focused on issues that matter to the people of Alabama health care, jobs, and the economy. Unfortunately, there has been little discussion about those issues in the bitter race of the last few weeks. These are not Democratic issues. These are not Republican issues. The people of Alabama deserve a senator who will put aside partisan rancor and address the real needs facing the people of this state. I understand the importance of bipartisanship. A Democratic president appointed me U.S. attorney and I was confirmed by a Republican-controlled Senate. After years of embarrassing headlines about top public officials in this state, this race is about the people of Alabama and about choosing a candidate with character and integrity they can be proud of. I will never embarrass the people of Alabama. I am running so the people of Alabama can be proud of their next senator. This job is much bigger than the occupant. As U.S. Attorney, I not only completed my term but remained a special prosecutor to ensure justice was served and Klansmen went to prison for murdering four innocent little girls. I will take the same seriousness to the United States Senate and ensure millions of Alabamians have a representative who places the people above personal ambition. Even though I was not on the ballot today, our campaign has been building momentum for weeks with hundreds of volunteers signing up to join our effort. Republicans reaching out to us throughout the state, and our campaign just finishing our strongest week of fundraising. We started our general election campaign more than a month ago and are seeing increased energy moving toward December 12. Louise and I wish Luther Strange and his family well as he continues to serve the people of Alabama during his remaining time in office. Copyright 2017 WBRC. All rights reserved.